Hello students, today in this video we are going to learn how to change reported speech when it is given in imperative sentence. Imperative sentence is that kind of sentence where we used to give commands, requests, orders etc. So here some of the rules are different. Uh, from the other sentences means from the assertive sentences and interrogative sentences in assertive sentences we use to attach we use to connect the sentence with a connector that right and in, in, in interrogative sentences we used uh, that if or whether right and uh, here if the sentence given to us is imperative to uh, then what we have to do here we have to use two plus verb first that is known as infinitive clear so that is a change that's a big change here two plus verb first we have to do rest all the rules are same here too and one very important rule that i forgot to mention that is when said to is given right or said is given so that said or said to change into requested ordered uh, suggested advised etc according to the nature of the sentence which is given here in reported speech that the sentence is giving uh, you know showing uh, request or order or suggestion what it is clear next see the sentence direct, uh, see the instruction given here for reporting an imperative sentence we use two infinitive two infinitive means two plus verb first after a reporting verb right so First sentence is the teacher said to the students go away. So answer would be what said to you have to change according to the nature of this sentence which is given in reported speech. So here when the teacher is uh, saying to the students so that would be what order right. So here what is that go away. So here the teacher ordered the students now we have done after reporting verb we have to attach two plus verb first so here it means at the place of commas two plus verb first is what go to go away full stop so that's a change next one she said to him please wait here till i return so here in this sentence she said to here the sentence given in your reported speech that is uh, that is showing the request because please is given here so what you will do she requested him to now when you have done requested here so it is understood it is already understood that uh, we will not uh, mention here please she requested him to wait here changes into there till i changes according to this object of so he and this verb first changes into verb second returned okay so that's why i said all the rules rest all the rules are same excluding this two and uh, requested an order right the captain said to this two soldiers march so the captain said to the soldiers comma march so it's what the captain commanded the soldiers so what you will do the captain commanded the soldiers to march directly so let's write down the captain commanded the soldiers to march now this is verb no so we will do small letter here this march is not a month march means to walk fast right so that was the doctor said to the patient commas go for a walk daily now the doctor is advising or suggesting 
the patient right that go for a walk daily so here what you will do the doctor advised or suggested so you will write down the doctor advised a d v i s e d you have to write down because s e that is verb advised the patient to go for a walk daily in the end full stop clear next one he said to her let me go now he said to her let me go so here also what you will do he requested her to let now me changes into him let him go he said to her let me go now right so here uh, see you will get these sentences where let is there of two types one is directly where you are doing the request and one is where where you are supposing something where uh, where you are proposing something right so what is that he said to her let me go here it is simple a request right so you will do he requested her to let him go right because this me we have to change with he so let him go here now let's see the difference here when the sentence is given again with let here it was directly let let me go so he was requesting him directly right but here i said to him let us go out let us go out means the person is proposing something or he is uh, suggesting something right so what you will do here the uh the person means what is that i said to him let us go out so here what you will do i suggested or proposed right so you will do suggested him now here one thing you have to do when there is suggestion or proposal so here you can add that clear so he suggested him that now this we us changes into what we because i and him so that is what we should go out see the difference so that is the difference where it is directly request and where it is a proposal or a suggestion so there what you have to do he said to him let us go out i suggested him that we should go out so here you have introduced two words here that is that and we should clear so like this you have to change the proposal and the suggestions right next see be quiet and listen to me attentively the teacher said to the students be quiet and listen to me attentively so what the answer uh, the teacher said to the students so how the teacher what is that ordered the students to be quiet and listen to me is given now right so here it may be her or it may be him so listen to him or her attentively clear so that your answer is go to the market full stop get some good biscuits here two instructions are given and the same instructions so here these both instructions can be joined with and the master said to the servant so what you will do the master 
ordered the servants to go to the market and to get some good biscuits that's it okay so here one uh, new thing you have learned when two sentences are given with the same structure same instruction you can join them with and so next one i said to him leave this place at once it's what order once again so i ordered him to leave that place this changes into that place at once last one is the principal said to the pian ring the bell so the principal ordered the pian to ring the bell so like this you have to change the sentences when it is given in imperative sentence okay so uh, just take a screenshot of this and practice such exercises thank you very much